this is the Surface Book, Microsoft's first laptop. And you know, by the looks of it, this thing is pretty amazing. The thing that stands out with this is this hinge. Now, Microsoft's talked a lot about this sort of this nebulous concept called lapability. It's the, the ability to put a, a Surface or a Surface Pro 3 in your lap and to have it feel comfortable and easy to use. And you know what? It's been sort of a mixed bag. There's been a sort of a kickstand that's dug into your legs and the hinge has always felt a little bit flimsy. This completely gets rid of all that. The hinge, in fact, sort of folds back and forth just like a normal laptop. If there's any disadvantage to this at all, it's that it doesn't fold all the way back as, say, a Surface Pro 3. In the front is a 5.0 megapixel camera. Now that camera at the top is also a Windows Hello depth camera. That's going to allow you to log in just using your face. And the rear is an 8 megapixel camera. What's interesting though, in the base, there is an optional NVIDIA GeForce discrete GPU. This makes this laptop great for productivity, but even great for gaming, and that's a big deal in the Microsoft universe. Now, Microsoft originally pitched this as a notebook, and everyone went, wow, but it's not. It's a two-in-one. This tablet comes off. Now, to remove it, you simply push and hold this button right here, and what it does is it releases the clamps, comes right off. This is actually connected by a technology called muscle wire. What it happens is it is a charge that's run through it. So when it's powered on, it grabs. When it's powered off, it releases. Microsoft tells us that the top, you should get about three hours of battery life just with the, with, with the tablet by itself. But plugged into the dock, that ups it to pretty much all day battery life of about 12 hours. So another thing you can actually do with this is you can remove it, flip it around, Fold it back, and bingo, you've got a folding tablet. But you've got a folding tablet with twice the power of a MacBook Pro. That's pretty awesome. So it comes in two versions one without the discrete GPU, and one with. Without, it's $14.99. With, it's $18.99. And it'll be out in October. You know, Microsoft calls this the ultimate laptop. And right now, it's hard to argue with them.